CrossFit Heat. All right, so today's workout is going to be for Thursday. All right, and that is going to be, we're going to consist on the warm up today is going to be an AMRAP for four minutes. All right, you're going to do 10 alternate plank walkouts. Now, how those planks are, you're going to get in that position, that push up position, and you're just going to walk out your feet one side to the other. All right, just like so. Then you're going to go into five and five on <clears throat> single leg RDL. So if you've got kettlebells or whatever you've got, you're just going down five on each leg. All right. Make sure you've got that knee slightly bent. Coming down and up. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Okay. Five on each leg. Then you're going to go into six to four calorie bike or row. Okay, all right. If you don't have that for a bike or a row, just go on ahead and what we'll do is uh, just do some alternating uh, jumping, jump squats, okay? Uh, then you're gonna go into a six minute EMOM. Minute one is gonna be 45 seconds on a bike, a rower, or a run, okay? So that's 45 seconds, good medium pace, get going, build up a ladder. Then. On minute two, is going to be 20 seconds of a single arm plank. So, you can be here, here, single arm plank. Alright, notice I'm extended, 20 seconds, and 20 seconds. You'll have, <coughs> you'll have 40 seconds for that total minute, you'll have 20 seconds of rest to go back on. So, a six minute EMOM, okay? Then, you'll go into your workout. Your workout will be an AMRAP for 14 minutes, all right? Workout will be hand release push-ups. The rep scheme, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, and so forth, okay? We're trying to get as many reps as possible. Uh, hand release push-ups. So we go down, hit, flash the hands, and back up. You'll do two, then you'll go to calorie bike or row. If you don't have any of those, then what you're gonna do is you will do alternate Jumping lunges, okay? Make sure you got a mat or somewhere that's not slippery from the humidity today, okay? Um, into double suitcase deadlift. If you don't have kettlebells or you have dumbbells or whatnot, find you something heavy that you can do a farmer's carry with. That you would do a farmer's carry, okay? And all we're doing is a deadlift. All right, slight bend in the knee, back, that butt up, squeeze at the top, okay? Uh, then your alternates for that, if you don't have those, you can use a backpack, all right? Sumo, okay? On those would be sumo. So if you do have one dumbbell, you can grab it on the edge or backpack and up. All right, so let me run through that one more time. If you have the equipment, it will be hand release push-ups, calorie row, row or bike, into double suitcase deadlift, all right? Or your alternates are hand release push-ups, alternate jumping lunges, again, Find somewhere where it's not slippery, okay, if it's humid tomorrow, or today, excuse me. Um, into backpack, sumo, deadlift, high pulls. Two, four, six, eight, all the way till 14 minutes is up. Easy enough, fun enough, gonna keep that heart rate going, just keep moving, all right? Y'all have a good evening, we'll see y'all soon.